Hey everyone, Delve here. Here's a quick guide on how to unlock the Lost in the Binding of Isaac Repentance. Firstly, the old convoluted method involving dying as four different characters at different points in a run no longer works. Instead, it's been replaced with a new method where you die to the sacrifice room spikes while holding the missing poster. Generally, this is the most painless way to unlock the character, and the way to unlock the missing poster is to beat the lamb as Isaac. I would say that if you ever encounter a missing poster in one of your runs, you should drop whatever you are doing and focus on looking for a sacrifice room, since missing posters are kind of rare. In fact, I hypothesize that some runs are seated to not have the missing poster in them, since it seems rarer than other trinkets. One thing you can try is to play as Eden, hoping you either start with the missing poster or Mom's box. That's how I unlocked the Lost on my second save file. But anyway, let's say you get unlucky and can't find the missing poster. The two items you need to unlock first are the Mysterious Paper, unlocked by beating Blue Baby as Eden, and then Divorce Papers, unlocked by beating Boss Rush as the Forgotten. I have a guide for how to unlock the Forgotten in the description. Now that you've unlocked those two items, start by playing Azazel and restarting until you spawn next to a Sacrifice Room. Next, kill the boss as fast as you can, and reset until Crack Jacks, the box, or Divorce Papers drops. If you get either Missing Poster or Mysterious Paper, simply use the Fool card, and then die on the Sacrifice Room spikes. Also, if you encounter a fortune telling machine along the way, make sure to play it as it can also be a source of trinkets. Keep in mind that the Mysterious Paper only has a chance to have the same effect as Missing Poster. This is kind of a grind method, and over the course of an hour I saw maybe two or three the box in a single Divorce Papers. But the reason you might want to try this is in case you have terrible luck in your other runs, or if you want to hurry and get the Lost and Locks as fast as possible since they are quite good. This way, if you encounter a missing poster in another run, you can save it for one of the end bosses, die right before fighting them, and then proceed to get an attempt at the boss as the Lost. A way to potentially cheat the Lost and Locks, assuming you already have him unlocked. There are of course two other methods. Spamming mom's box is a great way to do it, but I tried it and got multiple copies of the same trinket and never got the poster. Maybe it was just bad luck, but this is why I sought to develop another method. The other method I tried was, reset as Maggie until I started next to a sacrifice room, stand on the spikes until I'd spent three hearts, use to fill a health pill, and then on the fourth and sixth heart there'd be a chance to spawn a chest, meaning you could get up to two brown chests each having a chance of containing a trinket. In the end, I think this method would be overall slower than the Azazel and Divorce Papers strategy. So if you're unlucky and want a method for unlocking the Lost, the Azazel method is likely quicker than attempting to obtain it randomly in a run. Just toss on a YouTube video in the background and grind it out, if you're desperate. But I'd make sure to try spending at least some of your Eden tokens first. Hope this helps you unlock the Lost, and thanks for watching.